Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to the vlog today. Today's video is sponsored by Toy Story Drop. Bad news. He's been gone for like five minutes. They cannot find him. I'm so upset right now. <laughs> what are you crying about? You need to say a prayer and find him. Look, I have Millet. Yeah, he's gone. That's no good. You can find good, good in everything. Good morning. We are at the 20, I'm like 21 weeks, but it's the 20 week anomaly scan, anatomy scan, I don't know. One of those. We're getting an ultrasound. We're anatomy. gonna find- Anatomy, not wanting an anomaly right now. Well, <laughs> look at it Isn't says, an anomaly something that's off? Yeah, it tells you if there's something wrong. Oh, maybe it's anomaly. I don't know. Anyway, so we're gonna find out if baby's looking healthy. I want them to check all the things because I've had friends that have had crazy things like baby J, like I can't believe they didn't catch that in the anatomy scan of like his tubes being all jumbled. So I'm gonna be watching out for all the things and I hope that they do a really good job. I'm a little nervous, but that's that. So that's where we are. Um, we are sitting in a waiting room because that's what you do at doctor's offices, always. And Zayd and I decided that we're going to play this really fun game it's called Toy Story Drop. And I'm challenging you to level. What level should we do? What one are 20. you on? I'm on level three right now. But okay. there's a... we're gonna see who can finish it the fastest. And then we're gonna go to level three. Okay, here we go. Three. On your mark, get set, go. Is this level three? Yes. Okay, and we're we trying go. to get 40 of the the eye things. Hey, come watch it, baby. Come watch it. Hurry, they're going right now. You have 20 minutes. Yes. Yeah. What does it say that? Top left corner. Oh, you got limited moves. This oh, wait, he doesn't have limited moves because I've been playing longer. That's not fair. Oh, it's fair. <laughs> Baby, look. There's Woody. Say hi, Woody. Hi, Woody. Hey. Oh, that's a big one. Let's check on Zade. Dang it, I don't have Zade's any moves. quick in the thumbs. He's quick in the thumbs. That's supposed to go down. Did it? Zade won? Zade won. Ew. Too slow, slow. Okay, so slow. Claim your prize. Let's do it again. I challenge you again. All right, guys, they just called us back. We're going to head back and check out the whole anatomy scan of the baby. And I'm going to put a link in the description. You guys can check out this game. Also, go follow Toy Story Drop on all their socials. You're going to find all that information in the description below. Okay, where are we going? I don't know. I don't remember. You ever been here? Well, only once. Oh, my goodness. Ibi, you want to play, help me play the game a little bit while we're waiting? Okay, let's go. Here we go. There's pregnant ladies in here. Okay, we're at another, lost a life. We're at another waiting room. April has Dang challenged it. Zade again. No, she go back lost. to level four because no, I, I, I won with 12 moves. There's no beating okay, that. Level five. You had already okay, lost Okay, level me. five. Ew. Okay, go. Okay, here we go. April, I don't think you have a chance. I'm just sorry. Oh my gosh. Why is Zade so much better at this than me? If he has a higher IQ than me, I think. It could be your nails could be showing you No, I think he has a higher IQ than There's me. It's no not way. fair. No! Six moves left. Sorry, uh, April. I have nine moves now. left. Yeah, you're faster than me. AP, you see baby Frank out there? What does he look like? A shark. He looks like a shark? Yeah. Yeah, maybe he's a shark or maybe he's a baby, huh? Oh, he looks like an alien. Looks like an alien? Yeah. <laughs> you watching it, Evie? What do you think, Sid? It's pretty cool. Pretty cool, right? Evie, tell Mama good job. Good job. You did it. Did it. Thank you. Okay, so we just got out of there. We weren't able to film in there, but Eb. Video and pictures. Yeah, though. we got some video and pictures. Eb, you see that's baby Frank. You see his feet on the bottom down here. It's still a boy. And it's a boy <laughs> still. Was that fun seeing the baby Frankie? He looked healthy as can be, so that was no, a big relief. No strange anomalies happening <laughs> right now. Or are they oh, it's always so nerve wracking. I'm like, what are they gonna find? But I, was, I also had the opinion of no matter what. I'm you okay do with what it. You do. We just got to deal with it. I was hoping for some superpowers or maybe an <laughs> he extra. Did, he didn't have any extra legs or anything. Leg to run so faster. We're good. They <laughs> thought he looked like Iron Man, so that's a possibility uh, he still. He kept his chin tucked in the whole time. He never kind of looked up, so we didn't get a good profile, but hopefully he has a chin. 
<laughs> all right, we are not wasting any time. Time to clear out Paula's room and put Zade in it to make room for baby Frankie. Hey, I should do a bump date right now while I'm thinking about it. I haven't done one for a while. And so this is the 21 week bump date, 21 weeks. I'm 21 weeks and three days pregnant. And I think Frankie was measuring 20 weeks and six days or something. I don't know, I don't remember what she said. <laughs> but He's like a teeny weensy little bit too smaller than what it says, but it, here is the app I use. And like, look how this is, you can push this little button and it does the actual size. This is a iPhone 10s. So that lets you know about how big he is. It says he weighs about almost a pound, like 15.2 ounces. So really getting really close to a pound and almost 11 inches long. That's awesome. And it says today for the skin, your baby's skin is wrinkled and is a pinkish red color, but it's still translucent. So the skin's not all the way plumped up yet. Bone marrow, the bone marrow is making blood cells, a job previously done only by the liver and spleen. So now he has his little bone marrow doing the job like we have. And it says facial features, which I got to see in the ultrasound today. Um, whilst mostly sleeping, your baby is now able to blink and has eyelashes and eyebrows. Oh, that's awesome. I have been feeling a million percent better. <laughs> I do still get nauseous here and there if I forget to eat like often or something, but morning sickness is basically just gone away, which is hallelujah. I'm not having to take Unisom at night anymore. I'm feeling like myself, minus a big belly. It's harder to like roll over at night and I am getting a little bit of hip pain, but my hip pain started up again as soon as we went to Lake Powell and I brought my weights and I was gonna exercise. I had the best of intentions, but Keeping a good eye on Evie just made it like kind of hard and I just didn't didn't do it. So I took a week off and my hip started hurting. So I'm back at it again today um, and they've been a lot better. So that's good and things I've been craving. So buffalo wings, I'm just like finally able to eat spicy food again and I love it. And pickles and sauerkraut, anything vinegary. <laughs> it sounds gross, but I love it. Um, salty, yum, give it to me. Those salt and vinegar chips, I've been eating those like it's my job sometimes. I know, not the healthiest, but that's what I want. <laughs> I'm still craving the sausage breakfast burritos from Maverick, and every time I'm heading out in the morning, I grab one. They're so good. And what else? Yeah, I'm just getting really excited to finally get a nursery started. I literally have, like, two people have given me a couple gifts. Nintendo gave us, like, they sent like a cute little baby teether and like three swaddler cloths and a binky with a mustache, which is really cute. I'll have to show you guys later. And then I have like a breast, like a silicone breast pump that I bought and then a onesie that I bought in Greece. And I think maybe some freshly picked slippers that I had from like Jordan Soiree last year that I was gonna gift to someone else and turns out I need it. That is literally all the things I have. I need to get going, I need to get shopping, I need to get planning, I need to get the car, I do have a car seat and a stroller and a rocking chair. I need to get those things washed and ready for the baby. And, but I'm actually kind of getting excited to go baby shopping for clothes and actually the most exciting thing is I wanna get the furniture for the nursery because I think that's gonna be super fun. I did buy a rug, that's the only thing I have for the nursery so far. So this is gonna be like having my first time baby all over again. Super crazy. Really thought I was done, but here we go. Okay guys, I wanted to up you, update you on what's happening out here. Basically, we're taking back the Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. Um, I built this thing when it was, Zade was probably like four years old when I built it. And I turned it into a chicken cage when I built that playhouse over there. But like we're, we're getting this pool area back here ready for the pool. Uh, we're putting gravel down, we're cleaning it up. We thought about getting rid of that thing, but it's still a usable structure. That roof, that, that's gonna last another 36 years. Kinda nasty that the chickens were living in it, but I'm gonna clean it out, spray it out, spray paint it, and it'll be, be good as new. Bad news. Um, 
Daisy had Perry on her shoulder and went outside, which I told her not to do because I knew his wings weren't very clipped and he's a way good flyer. And he's gone. He's been gone for like five minutes. They cannot find him at all, anywhere. I'm so upset right now. <laughs> what are you crying about? You need to say a prayer and find him. Look, I have Millet. Perry! Yeah, he's gone. That's no good. I don't know what to do. Maybe we should put his cage outside with a bunch of millet in it and see if he comes back. Will it come back? Yeah. They're smart. Perry! Hey, I see him! You down there? Yes! Perry! There he is. <gasps> You're so lucky. Come here, Daisy. <laughs> Care of that, Perry. Daddy didn't give up, did he? Don't do that. Hey, Daisy, go down and get it. Here, Daisy, I'll lower you down. Grab my hands. Grab Two my hands. hands. Take my hand if you want to live. Aww. Put some millet in your hand. Yep, he'll stay there. Oh. See, Daddy didn't give up when all y'all wanted to give up. Okay, get him in the house and we'll clip his wings. Daisy, you're the luckiest girl in the world. Perry, naughty boy, we're gonna cut your wings so short. <laughs> Man, what an eventful day. So relieved to hear that everything looks good with baby Frankie, especially because I had um, the flu right when I found out I was pregnant, like four to six weeks. I was so sick. So I was really nervous. I just thought, I honestly thought when I was first found out I was pregnant that there's no way this baby can survive, but he's thrived and <laughs> he'll be one tough cookie. What? Oh no, I don't have any towels, so I'll go get some. Anyway, it's a relief. And then losing Perry and finding Perry. And, oh my goodness, what a day. Cleaning out Paula's room. <laughs> oh. All right, it's looking really nice. Dad's been working all day leveling and putting in rocks. We're gonna fill it in with pea gravel and pea gravel all that, put the pool in. It's gonna be real nice back here, real nice. Why are they Maybe we'll even get a couple of those little bucket hanging chairs. We're laying these all down. Gravel comes tomorrow. And um, we'll be swimming they by- They wanted to charge us $3,000 to do this, but Davey said, I'll do it myself. It's been working hard. They might have done a little bit more clean job, but it'll be fine for the pool. <laughs> okay, let's get these going over there. Evie just got hurt, but what the heck? This is the kind of crap you find. This is a stick of butter. When summertime hits, the kids are home eating whatever they want. Someone took a bite of butter. I'm guessing it was her. What happened? Some blocks fell on her toe. Oh, blocks fell on your toe, the big blocks. I would kiss your toe better, but I think you stepped in chicken poo and I shouldn't do it. Should I do it? No. No, I shouldn't do it. You wanna go take a bath in my bath? What? I want a bath. Only if you smile. <laughs> okay, okay, let's go. Wait, 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 wait. Are you still sad? The blocks. Do you want me to go spank the blocks? Yeah. <laughs> For hitting you? Yeah. No, no, blocks. You are grounded in time out, naughty blocks. Like that. Yeah, I'll go get a block for you to spank. Okay, go get a block, Daisy. She's going to let you be spanked a block. <laughs> okay, spank them. Block. <laughs> I'll better you be okay. <laughs> <laughs> I have to ask you, Evie. Are these your teeth marks? Yeah. You bit the butter? Yeah. You opened a whole cube of butter and bit into it. <laughs> Don't your mama oh feed you? Oh my gosh. I did Why feed do her. kids eat butter? I made like her breakfast, lunch, and dinner, thing. and she had a snack. Call. Throw this away. Evie, you're weird. Straight to the Oreos. And Oreo. Butters and Oreos. Okay. <laughs> All right, guys, ending the vlog now. We have something super funny and exciting planned tomorrow for you. Um, tune in, and don't forget, um, check out the link in the description below, and there, there's that awesome game, Toy Story Drop. Go check it out, download it, check it out. And thank you for watching this video, and thanks again to Toy Story Drop for sponsoring this vlog, and we will see you guys tomorrow. Find good in everything. Bye-bye.